Hello sweethearts and welcome to another video. Today I'm having homemade Belgium waffles along with boiled eggs and beef sausage and a glass of milk and my favorite Aunt your mama syrup. You see I only got a little bit left so you know I've been handling it. Okay, let's get into the prayer first. Dear Lord, let us be truly thankful for the nourishment we're about to receive for our body. Amen. And amen to you too. Do you have your meal of the day? I'm going to give you a couple of minutes to go get your meal. Go on. You got your meal? Great. We're going to get into eating. Oh boy. So how was your day? How was your day? My day was awesome. I don't think I'm going to drench both of them just yet. I'm going to take care of this one first. <clears throat> My day was awesome. My day was awesome. Very... Very, very um, quiet and busy at my job. Busy is always good for me. I like it when it's busy. First time me making homemade Belgian waffles. Mm-mm-mm. Mm. And they are so good. Mm, mm, mm. They are the only big sausages I like. My daughter's, <clears throat> excuse me, my daughter's friend brought over her waffle maker and made all of them waffles. So I said, I'm going to have waffles for my video tonight. She offered to make me some, but I said, ah, I'll make it myself. Turned out pretty good. She did make up the batter for me. She put a hurt on that batter. And the confectionery sugar, that stuff is very sweet. Very sweet. You know you gotta have your milk with either waffles or your pancakes. You got to have your milk. Mm. Mm. I made them pretty big too. This my hair is really big.
<clears throat> I think she said <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> she got the waffle maker from Walmart. So now I have to get me a waffle maker. Along with me a uh, uh, one of them air cookers. Air fryers. I'm definitely getting one of those. Because I've been seeing so many YouTubers using those for their flaming hot Cheetos um, crab legs and king crab and flaming hot Cheetos pickles. Toss, toss point fro. That's her ingredients. That's her invention, rather. I have to try it. have to try it having breakfast for dinner because it's nighttime guys and I'm having this for dinner seen a video the other day a young lady at my job brought it to my attention and asked me did I see it and of course I didn't see it so she pulled it up for me excuse me very, very disturbing. <clears throat> the video was showing four teenagers taking away an elderly lady cane. And once they got the cane away from her, they started beating her with it. Where is this world coming to? Where is the respect for the babies, the youth, and the elderly? Just because they cannot defend themselves does not give you the right to abuse them. was very, very upset. That could have been my grandmother. That could have been my mother that these young kids beat with her own cane. She had to go to the hospital. Luckily, she was, she was fine. But it could have turned out a lot worse. Where is the respect for your elders? Where, where is it? Excuse me. 
uh, excuse me, very, very sad. But you figure you in a crowd with your friends and your friends are being disrespectful. So you want to join in and do it too. It ain't all about only black kids do this. Only white kids do this. Only Indian kids do this. Only Spanish kids do this. They all do it. They all do it. Because in that video, didn't look like only one type of race in there. Okay? It's just a sad situation. It really is. And it hurts me to my heart. She have children too. She have a family too. It's sad how we treat the elderly and children. It's sad. And it's sad because I don't think anyone even helped her. And if they did help her, it wasn't said on the news. I think my friend said that <clears throat> this happened a couple of weeks ago, maybe like two weeks ago. If that. I got very angry seeing that. Very angry. These kids get out here, do all kind of stuff, and then go home and act like they ain't did nothing. Like they haven't done anything. And then when it comes down to it, you're pointing fingers. He did it. He did it. She did it. I think that video had two girls and two boys. Come on now. That ain't right. It's not right. Not right. Very irritating. That's why I don't like to watch the news. Because there's so much negativity on the news. So much. This world is just full of negativity. That's why you have to be positive. You have to be positive. Thinking, positive actions, positive conversations. Try not to get involved with negativity. Because it's very easy to, to, to be soaked into it. Very very easy. Before you know it, you're having a negative conversation. Or you're doing something negative. Are you laughing about somebody? Are you making fun of someone? Instead of making fun of someone, help that person. Offer to help them in some type of way. Sometimes people only need one hello or one can I help you or one is there anything I can help you with. It takes nothing to smile or to be kind. Nothing. It don't cost you anything. Don't cost you nothing.
So don't fall into the negativity. Don't fall into that bucket. Because there's a whole lot of crabs trying to get out. A whole lot. And you making one more makes it even heavier. Life is too short, guys. Live your life to the fullest. And be positive when you're doing it. Look at my egg. Pepper and salt. Mmm, -hmm. look. I wish I had some of B-Love sauce with this. Do you know I'm still waiting on my package? They said the 23rd, which is Monday. So when I get my package, I'm going to do a review on it. I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to make it. <clears throat> I'm going to do it just like her. And I'm going to get some seafood. And I'm going to eat for you guys. I am waiting, waiting for my package. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I'm not going to say patiently. Because I look, <clears throat> look at my stoop every time I come home. And I call my sister and ask her that I get a package. So I stopped calling her now because it's the 23rd. So let's see, on Monday. Let's see if it comes on Monday. Ain't nothing like boiled eggs. Mm -mm -mm. But I know that B-Love sauce dip this egg in it and bring out all that ginger with garlic and onions on this. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, I can just imagine this has it on there. Mm. Now I'm disappointed because it don't. But yeah, guys, try to stay positive. Try to stay positive. It's not, it's not hard to stay positive. It's not hard. It's not hard to be positive. Just be positive. That's all. gonna be a short one guys this is gonna be a short one I thank you for eating with me like comment subscribe share this video with all your family and friends and don't forget to hit the notification button okay so you could be notified for all my upcoming videos I love you and stay positive Mwah, mwah, mwah.